our students come from a wide range of backgrounds, wide range of experiences, different age ranges, the typical graduate, the more mature graduate. And really it's um, supporting students to develop these new skills in this integrated way. So within our school it's not just exposure to science or to technology, but it's this entire integrated STEM platform that is a real strength. We have excellent facilities with regards to environmental pollution, so our analytical equipment, our inorganics lab, our organics lab is, is state of the art. And not only do we have the equipment, but we have dedicated technical teams to support us in using this equipment. Um, and so Middlesex is specifically sought as a partner, for example, to provide water quality expertise on a number of projects. Um, so the government, as part of its economic policy, has specifically stated that it needs more graduates in this area and that's the kind of graduates that, that we're able to produce, to produce from this school. I did my PhD here um, and then I've been able to have the support to develop my career um, through research, through a research fellow, senior research fellow and now I'm a reader in um, sustainable water management. I've recently been invited to give a keynote at a meeting in Sweden so really I've had a lot of opportunity um, to develop my own interests and to develop my career. When I'm lecturing on environmental pollution I can give examples and case studies of, of latest developments from the research projects I'm involved with. Some of the subjects can perhaps seem a bit abstract but if you have experts coming in who talk about how they use these um, within their day-to-day -day activities, it, it helps paint a clearer picture and makes it seem more relevant. Mm -hmm.